Hello everybody and welcome to My Hero Academia Smash Rising. My name is Scarface King. Uh, I, I'm i still undecided on whether I hate this game or not. I, 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 I log in every day, I play it a little bit, I mean I'm not... It's not like some other games where I've basically completely stopped playing in hope that an event will come along and and reignite my passion for it. With this game, I have been playing a little bit each day, not a lot, granted, compared to certain other games. Just one login, do a bar of stamina, then be done, sort of thing. Um, but we got a new banner, and I mean, you know how it is. We got All Might. All Might's cool. I've got a few cool All Might cards, so might be oh, clicked the wrong thing. Might be an opportunity to uh, you know start using him. Alternatively, we have Froppy, which is the only reason we're pulling on this banner. Um, so yeah, let's jump into it. See what we can get. Um, I, I I only want the Froppy card. That's all I want. I don't. I don't ask for much out of this game, so I could just get that. That'd be oh my box is full. What? No. Okay. Never mind. I misread that. It's fine. I still found I still find this sound to be incredibly obnoxious. I'm gonna turn it down just a tad. Blue stack. Stop this madness. Okay. New card. Cool. Is this more, I think this is more the kind of level we want. It's just a more annoying background sound than anything else. The summon animation is not. So one thing I've learned since the last video is that not getting that flash at the end does not mean you don't have a five star. It all might can still show up after that and you can get a five star. I don't know beyond that if you just get Deku, that you can still get a 5 star. I don't know that for sure. But I do know that you can get a 5 star without it doing that extra bit there. It didn't do it there. So had All Might shown up there, I could have still got a 5 star. But, I don't know. Um, I've said this on numerous occasions. Uh, if you're a gacha game, the summon animation... Sometimes is almost more important than certain other things in the game that you've probably put a lot of effort into. Um, because that's what people are here for. It's a gacha game. People want to pull. People want to pull cool stuff as well. Um, needless to say, I'm one of those people. Play a lot of these gacha games. And... I don't know. I just, I just wish more gacha games would put a bit more effort into the summon animation. Um, I know Dokan recently revamped theirs. I say recently, it was quite a while ago, but, you know, considering how long it had been the way it was before. Um, and I think I think the summon animations in general were received quite positively. I, quite, I think they're quite good. I think they're quite good. Um, just, I wish some games would put just a little bit more effort. I'm not asking for a lot. Let's jump into a multi here. We did a few singles and we did a multi, a few singles, whatever. We're basically stopping if we get Suyu's card. That's that's it. Can we get the extra frobby bit? It didn't do the thing. Can we get All Might show up? Hey, see? There you go. That's a five star. And we did get a frobby card, but it's not the one we're looking for. Ah, uh, it's Hatsume Mei. And I think I already have that card. If not, then, well... I didn't really want it, <laughs> so thanks, I guess. Um, not ideal, not what we were looking for in our first multi, but that's that's okay. Um, what, three more singles and then a multi and then, and then one more multi to finish it off and then we're bankrupt. Supposedly, there's there's a decent amount of hero souls to be, to be garnered from doing uh, story mode and stuff. We'll see how true that is later down the line. Um, and I'm kind of falling for the bait here. 
because these these first few banners, um, including the Rise and Fest Deku, um, but this banner, the last banner with the Bakugo on it, and whatever banners that are coming up in the future, until we get our next Rising Fest, are basically all bait, in my opinion. Um, we'll see how true. Again, we'll see how true that is because uh, you know. I've been wrong in the past, but it, it, the immediate banners that come out after an update are almost always bait. Not not just in Smash Tap or Smash Rising, sorry. In almost every game, that's just how it is. Um, I mean, I don't know. Smash Rising is kind of a whole new thing. Like, I don't know any other gacha games that legitimately just basically deleted everything that happened before and started again. So... I don't know, but I feel like once once I uh, am allowed to put my costumes on my characters again. Oh, hey, we got a five star, and we got we got all my shot for the for the banter. Can we please get see you? No, five star. That is not new. I'm, sh I'm sure I've got that card. Uh, I know I have that card. You had a lot of new ones here, actually. Nothing I care about, though. Hey! Hey! We're done! We're out! Fuck all my. <laughs> Fuck all my. I don't care about that shit. Oh, never mind! Never mind! Okay! We'll take that too! There you go! So. I get to save my last 50 souls. I get to hold on to those. Because I, I recorded, recorded a full... A few, fucking hell, I can't talk. I recorded a few videos in this little block here. And um, the other ones were varying levels of success. But this one has gone very well. So I'm, I'm very happy to end the video here. And say thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you all next time.